Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Guys, I have something to say, and this is what I don't want you to do. Because apparently, if you're watching YouTube, right, you, you nine times out of ten have a YouTube channel, right? Whether you use it or not, where some people just have it and then you just follow other stuff, right? And then, but you do have a platform, right? And you do have a mic and you have a phone. So you can, you can say what you want. You can put your life out there if you want. You can talk about it if you want. Guys, right here, right now, with this cross. Right here, right now, put your hand on the cross and promise me. Promise me that whatever happens with your relationship, your marriage, your situation, anything like that, you're not going to lose yourself and start talking crap online about your person. You're not going to talk down about your person. You're not going to do that because when you're talking about them, you're also putting your business out there. Guys, make the promise to yourself. Because there's a lot of people on social media that when their relationships go wrong, they have the need to talk to everybody in the world who really don't give a damn, right? Like, the world doesn't care about your relationship. I mean, we'll listen to it. We'll, we'll listen to you act a fool, right? But guys, promise me that that is not what you do. Handle it like you would normally handle it. Handle it as if there is no internet, right? Handle it between you two, silently, privately. Don't put that stuff online. Do not put your life online. No one cares. I'm going to tell you how much they care. They care enough to look at you, to laugh at you, to be like, oh, my God, I would never. Like, don't be that person. Don't be that person, even though you have a mic right there with your phone. You just press play. You can record and blast it to the world. No one cares. No one cares because then you get dragged across the Internet. You get dragged across the socials. Everybody flips your stuff. And it's not worth it. It's just not worth it, guys. Just, mm. Because in between my recordings, guys, I look at them. And I just saw somebody, right? And I'm like, why? Why are you guys doing this to each other? Like, where was the love? Where is, you know? Anyway. Anyway. Obviously. You don't do that. Holy Spirit. The karmics are out. The karmics came out in the previous reading. Let's see if they want to show it right now. Hey, karmics. Introduce yourself, Karmic. Come on out. Somebody chose you, Karmic. Why they choose you, Karmic? Tell me. <laughs> we want to know. Okay, so this Karmic has the key. On what? On who? On what are you going to do with the receipt? Karmic's materialistic. She wants people to buy her things. I, I want the finest things. I want the finest things in life. I want the finest things. I want a Prada bag. I tell you what, you buy your first product bag, I'll buy your second one, right? That's what I would do if I was a guy. I'd be like, you know what? If you can buy it, I'll want it. People be saying these things. People, the materialistic people want things that they can't afford. Now, if you can't afford it, go you, right? Do you. Ain't, ain't nothing wrong with it. This karmic is tracking somebody. They're, they can track somebody. Maybe they track this person to your house. Who the hell knows? Maybe those are the receipts. Maybe the receipts are popping up on their GPS, just tracking the guys here. Another woman. Yeah, they track another woman. They tracking you. Either that or you're the karmic. You're dragging them out. But my people aren't karmic. I'll be damned. And if you are a karmic, you stop today. You, you stop today, right? There's no karmic. So this karmic here is out there doing her due diligence, doing what they do best, and they're watching and wishing and hoping and praying and tracking and lurking. Holy Spirit, karmic, what kind of receipts you have? Who the hell, right? What do you have? You know you're materialistic. You're tracking the other woman. Why? 
Wow, what you going to do? The Wheel of Fortune. Maybe they feel somebody got the Wheel of Fortune. They're moving on. Yeah, they do. Somebody's moving on. And their world is ending. So they're not going to get as many gifts as they used to get, right? You're not going to get those gifts anymore. Yes. Somebody's walking away from Con Con. Somebody dropped their burden. So whoever dropped your burden, they're tracking you to wherever you're going. They got that person's phone on lock. Because they can tell that they pulled their feelings back. Karmic knows that this man pulled his feelings back for this other woman here. Karmic, they don't want to play. They don't want to play with you no more, right? They're tired of you. probably asking too much stuff. You asking too much. Can you give me this? Can you give me that? Sending links and stuff to people. Can you buy me this? Can you buy me that? Can you do this? I ain't your daddy. Gifts like that. You shouldn't ask for that. Gifts like that should be given to you. Birthday, holiday, Christmas, however they want. Maybe they just want to get you. I don't know. But you don't ask for stuff like that. You don't ask. Didn't your mama teach you not to ask for stuff like that? Don't, don't be acting all needy. Be acting all needy. So Carmen's going to track this man to this person's house. She's losing her strength. She doesn't feel as strong as she used to. Uh, she's feeling a little weak. She's feeling a little weak. Yeah, because she knows that this person dropped their burden. They're about to offer their love to someone else if they haven't already. They're on their way. They're on their way. It's over. The sun is in reverse. There's no more happy times. This person is happy with this other woman. So they probably track this man to your house or track him to your job, track him somewhere. But they got a GPS on his phone. Or on his car. See, Carmen missed this opportunity with this person. Probably because she was begging for too much, asking for too much, being all needy, being materialistic, being fake. It's fake. It's fake. Holy Spirit. Yeah, this person moved on with the quickness. Knight of Swords. Upright. They're rushing to get away from this Carmen, right? They're like, you trying to use me. Yeah, they're going to this full cup. Where they can work well together. It'll be teamwork, right? It'll be teamwork, right? Mm -hmm. Teamwork would be, you want that Prada bag. Prada bag is 5000 right? So you go to your man, you're like, hey, I was looking at this Prada bag. And can you go half with me? See how that sounds? Can you go half with me? Well, how much you got, babe? I got 2500 How much is the bag? Five. All right, I got you. Damn. They'll respect you for that. But if you constantly asking, constantly taking and stuff like that, no, that gets old. It gets really, 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 really old. It gets old. So this person done moved on mm, to their wish fulfillment. To they wish fulfillment. This person has moved on. They're going to get this other woman if they're not already don't have her. Holy Spirit, who is this other woman? Mm hmm King of Swords in reverse. The other woman, you was manipulated. Like, you probably didn't even know about the karma, but you do now. You, they manipulated you. They want to come and talk to you about it, though. They do. They're going to tell you where they went wrong, where they went left, because you're their wish fulfillment. You're their star. You're their everything. Three of Wands in reverse. They're leaving that person empress in reverse. Infidelity, all that stuff. So not only are you asking for bad karma, but you cheating. You cheating. Holy Spirit, clarify this empress in reverse. It could be a baby's mom, child's mom, something like that. That don't mean you get everything. Hell, y'all got kids. The stuff I used to buy you, I can't anymore. I give it to my children, right? I can't anymore. Yeah, this person is finding balance. This person, the karma, unreliable. Can't trust you. There's the tower. There's the tower. Stop asking for things. Stop asking for things. Get it yourself, right? Buy him something expensive, right? No, he may not want he may not want a bag. He may not want the things you want, but guess what? He needs new tires on that truck. Guess what? One tire on that truck. Five hundred dollars, right? 
I'm just saying because the tires on my car, because they low profile, the tires on my car are like 325 each. Right? And that's just a sedan. So I'm thinking, this person got a truck. Buy him a set of wheels. Karmic. And then maybe he'll get you a bag or two. You know what I mean? Stop asking. Stop asking. Stop asking. So I guess Karma's gonna show you the seat that he he buys me Prada bag. Yep, that'll be the last bag you get. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. <laughs> That's gonna be the last bag you get. So guys, Ten of Pentacles in reverse. And there's no new beginnings. This person's not coming back. He's probably broke. Who the hell knows? You're not getting this one back, baby. So, man, sir, whoever you are, yeah, you's a sneaky ass, Carmen. You real sneaky. This Carmen's sneaky. Yes. That ain't the only person she's doing. He's the gifter, and she she gifting other people. Knight of Wands in reverse. I'm reliable. Can't trust it. No, 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 no. And that's why they're offering their love to someone else. It's over. So Karmic knows it's over because they don't track this man to your house, to your place, to whenever y'all go out to eat. Yes, here he comes. He gonna swim away in common waters. He wants peace. He wants peace. And guess what? He wants to see his hard-earned money in his savings account. Men can't build when you got a beggar asking for everything all the damn time. They want this woman. Look how look look how simple she is. She's nice. She's a natural woman. She can put her wigs on, but she also got a head full of hair. She reads books. She has downtime. She's quiet. She's feminine. She's mm, mm, mm. and she hasn't asked for anything. You know what she asked for? Her? Hey babe. Can you buy me some books? <laughs> Can you buy me some books? Absolutely. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe.